Dear 2017, we started off on the wrong foot. I'm sorry about that. The year I declared as mine began as anything but my own. I can't recall how many nights I spent overthinking, attributing way too much to people who could have never given me what I needed. But as time went on, I think I realized that. I put an end to my routine of endless naps and pity parties alone in my room. I decided that I wanted to be there for myself, to learn about myself, to put myself first. All I wanted was to stop being met with a stranger every time I looked in the mirror. So I did it all. Got a taste of what it's like to be a reckless teen, turned being reckless into life lessons, reignited some sparks that I should have just let burn out, traveled to new, breathtaking places where I was reunited with the ocean, learned true independence in moving away for college, made a temporary home in a city I never thought I'd be able to love, faced demons and anxieties that I denied for too long, wrote songs that I sing in the shower, in the car, and before I fall asleep at night, reminded myself family is what's most important, worked my way through a labyrinth of issues that wholly disappeared once I stepped out. But most importantly, I found myself. Through my wounds, my flaws, my exponential mistakes, and through my words, my heart, and the lightning bolts that keep me awake. I am now unapologetically me. This year has been the best year of my life so far. Thank you, 2017, for the wild nights, the light in my eyes, and the lust for life you have given me. Here's to another year of growth, joy, and selfless love. I really don't see how 2018 can be any better, but I welcome the challenge with open arms. Forever yours, Reyna.